What is up guys, Ops Nerd Show here, back again playing Jurassic World Evolution, continuing on playing in our park here. So we're on Isla Manta, Man, Montessera, I always, I said the name wrong, I know that much, I don't see the name anywhere to be able to pronounce it correctly, but we're continuing on with the story mode here. So I did do a little work, so we had our path here we created last time to this um, little park here, so this is our carnival area carnivore area and so we I added this little viewing area over here so if you go into the view things and we look at our sites we have it pretty much covered and I do would like to add another one over here for the herbivore area as well um, that will do and I create a path that does not look too good at all but we run into the wall here so I made little curves out there but on this side as you can see by the mission we have over here we do have a thing to release a ceratosaurus um, it said at least 50% so I'm hoping this does it since it's over 50% so look at our big bad guy going in here to add it with our other one Rawr, it's good. do you rock you're taking forever there we go just roar it all up so we release that guy then we do we yeah we did get oh, we're so close to reaching the profit thing we do that by making sure their needs are met awesome so it's socials getting really high just with more demands and less understanding. So actually, let's right? see if we can do some landscaping, smooth out some Things of this good here, huh? ground. I love what you're doing with the place. There, just That's smooth out well some done. of the area. It's kind of annoying me that it looks like that. Um, so yeah, we can play with the thing ferret, how to demolish trees and all that sort of stuff. Your rep is off the charts. Power, so getting a reward for the power a clothes shop. Okay. On Isla Man and so let me go ahead in here. I also have an Edmonton source all um, done up there. And then once this gets done, I have another dino because I finally, with all the research and everything, I think I need to send out for more research as well. There's our Edmonton source. That's our first one for this episode. So let's go ahead get a picture of that thing. Edmonton Sword. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's our first one because I think we only have two trikes because our Struthamimus died. This dinosaur, Everything there. So it looks like it does need a couple more. The uh, social is pretty uh, low, so I appreciate sure that means you need more. And who's to argue? It's got the perfect grassland, all that sort of stuff, so that is doing perfectly fine. We got, our, of course, our viewing gaze in there. Um, our two carnivore things there. Um, let's check. I don't know what to send out for next. Let's go back to this. Where is it? Oh, there it is. The Hoang, whatever Hoanga source thing, because that's pretty low in our groupings there. Okay, let's get out of that. And power protection. Yay. Oh, that was the thing I researched. I forgot about that. Oh, I did. I do it. I'm oh my my stuff okay but let's go and here we'll do our research for this try and get higher ceratosaurus genome but I did I think I closed out of it but we can go in here and look I did get we'll go and incubate dinosaur 100% on the struthiomimus so we have 100% viability so we're not gonna have any issues we can modify the genome if we want to um, you of course decrease the viability but there are the viability increases you can do um, but it doesn't add anything to age or anything because that's what we kind of want since our last one died of old age that one does increase the lifespan and just very little decreases the viability of course it adds some cost to incubating includes our rating let's go ahead and do that just to make it a little bit better see if we can do anything here Ooh, that increases it quite a bit. I get, oh, it's the same. Yeah, we'll go ahead and do it. Like I said, we'll just, it'll last a lot longer as well. So there we're up to 85, down to 79, which is still isn't bad for a percentage. I think we'll just apply all that. Of course, like I said, it costs a lot more. So we have that now and it's down to 79. Let's see if we can um, go back real quick and see if we can uh, add any upgrade success rate. We do have, which I think you can just buy 
Oh, it's locked. So this, I think you can just increase a whole bunch of the ratings, but that increases it by 10%. We'll just go ahead and do one for now. And we'll go with Incubate Dinosaur. So it, yeah, it's 10%. It, so it'll be up to 89. That's still pretty dang good. We'll go ahead and incubate the Struthiomimus there. So yeah, we got that going. Let's see if we can get any more genomes or any new upgrades done. Fossil. No, we need... Reset. Is it the creation lab that we need? Which we have to unlock certain stuff to get to that. So that's not going to work for anything. So we can ignore that. Oh, we got a new one. This is a side hustle that we should get behind. Yeah, I can do that as well. Do that. So we need to construct a clothes shop. So we can throw that up real quick. So let's go into the guests. And we need gift shop, fast food, clothes shop. Yes, let's go ahead and add a clothes shop. Probably, um, I don't know where would be a good spot to throw it in. Oh, that's not too bad, right over here. Pretty centrally located and everything, that's, you know, perfect. I assume it'll be powered, because surely, I, oh, I may just need to add a power station here. Let's go ahead and look at our map real quick. Um... I guess that's not, oh shoot, no, I think that was the view. Power, yeah, we're at, we need to put a power. So we need to put a power path, yes, like in here, we'll put it right over in here so it covers up this gap a little bit. And we'll rotate it around just a little. Let's back out and go with the landscape, see if we can smooth this out this area any, and then allow it. To go in there hopefully let's see now oh yes there we go so that way it kind of so if we want to put stuff something over here obviously it'd have to be pretty small there we go and it should be all powered up there we go we got our clothes all set up to give our guests make them appreciate the little things so yeah got pretty low expenses that's kind of cool glassy eyes that could swallow them whole I don't know why it went into this. Let's see if we can get, if you build it, emergency, oh yeah, the emergency cell to shelter. Um, what do we want to do? What's her thing? The science division is always on the lookout for ways to improve our bottom line. I guess we can do that. So I guess we can't do any of that. Okay, so let's build a power shelter, or a shelter, whatever you want to call it now. I'll probably do it right over in here. Let's go with. Wait, what is it? Const live bait feeder. I. Oh, okay. Build and connect an emergency shelter. Where are those? At? Probably in here. Nope. Guess there it is. Emergency shelter. Yeah, right in here is where I would like to do that. we'll put that there and so it's all set up there so we need to fill that let's go ahead and put our live bait feeder here as well you know let's kind of place it over here so people can really get a view of this when of course they eat the live the goat there we go so we've got a live bait feeder in there. We also need to. Um, I think it's. I forget how you do this. Oh, we got a transmission. What'd we get? We well, got a mission complete commercial park. Draco Rex. Awesome. We got a new dino. Oh, there's the goat. Hey, way to go. Unlock got there. Park running at maximum happiness, and our guest numbers are up as a result. That's what makes the entertainment division. Let's see. Is the car gonna go for the goat that's running around over there? When the parks are running well, our scientific research improves. Of course, I'd never tell this to Isaac directly. Or right, so. I was going to add. The no. Truck should be gone, no. and they're all no, no, arguing. No, no, no. Those two. Too late. Heard it. Later, Doc. Ugh. Everywhere I look. So yeah, I we got the shelter. 
done, which should be fine. I don't think there's any storms or anything. Oh yeah, the truck's going to feed that now, or to refill. As you can see there, they'll be doing their little own business so we don't have to worry about it. Oh, there's the one, what you call it, guy, Ceratosaurus, eating the goat. He's all fed now. <laughs> Go ahead and add tab. I guess we'll go ahead and I ah, will go ahead and leave that empty for now they have that feeder to eat off of um, so let's go into the expedition and we'll send out for we did get the um, Huangasaurus thing whatever you want to call it oh we did, got the Draco Rex I forgot about that Draco Rex I tear it I try Triceratops we'll go ahead and do that one so that's awesome so hopefully that will count as our thing there so let's go in here, and I forgot we have our Struthiomimus that we will release. Of course, that got incubated. So here's our really good genome, Struthiomimus. Interesting. Another dinosaur that furthers the and case I of a dinosaur. I want to do another one too, just to get, because it can obviously take a lot of stuff in here. So let's turn around there. We need, actually, should probably do two. We'll do another Struthiomimus. And another Edmonton Saurus. Um, yeah, it's not good enough genome to do all that. Um, so we've got that. Now let's go with our fossils since we should have the Hoanga Saurus thing. Sell that. Extract and extract. Get that raised up so we can get that dino going and released. And what do we need? Oh, yeah, expedition for small. Or medium herbivore fossil which should be worked on there let's go ahead and see if we can add another building I want to put in a hotel too I don't know exactly where I want to place it but we'll have to do it somewhere I forgot that this is oh I guess that's the thing reached maturity so go ahead and place this one and we'll hit the what's it rotate obstructed by what yes I know it's not got power okay let's go ahead and that's not what I wanted see if we can take up some of this water since I obviously don't think we need that much water take out some of these trees as well on both sides and then we'll smooth out the ground here make sure it's all smooth now let's try to put a building in we'll just put it there I don't know what's going on with that then we'll need to demolish some of that clear out more of the trees here And then put a new path down. We'll go ahead and continue on with the old one. I switch obviously to like the newer path. And then try and like curve it around here just to make it look all nice for a view out to the park there. And then we'll add road like that there we go and I don't know if we need power it looks like it is powered so that is good let's go ahead and do our views it's not showing it doesn't need power or isn't out of power so it should be fine there um, did I get another thing going over here no I did not let's get another ceratosaurus going they're super expensive but I have a buttload of money as you can see okay and our dino should be good Range taking care of at least one Edwin Source drinking. For this I should be able to do that, especially as I get ready to release the Edmonton Source. So let's go ahead and back out of here, get our truck, and drive the vehicle. Let's hope we don't run into anybody. But it's not like it matters. Watch out, people! Coming through! Move out the way! Hi, dinos. So 
we're just gonna park them all the way over here. And then we'll come over here and release the Edmonton Source. And we'll just go ahead and skip since we already saw that. And there's our truck at. Go back to our truck here. Get in picture mode, see if we can watch when it comes out as we can see all the way over there. Ladies and gentlemen, we are pleased to welcome an Edmontosaurus to the house. There we go. Wrong. Come to the water so we can take a picture. This may take a little bit. I'll see you when we get the picture though. And it's coming in to get a drink of water now, so here we go. It's gonna be perfect timing. Come on, drink the water. Drink the water. You know you want to. Drink it. Ooh, double drinkers. There we go. You we took did this it. photo all by yourself, huh? <laughs> yeah, I did. I can't thank you enough, which means I'm not gonna try. Let the truck drive back by itself. Awesome, awesome, we did that. Okay, let's see, is everything okay? We got, oh yeah, grasslands, forest, perfectly fine for that. Trikes, grasslands, forest, social, perfectly fine. And where's our sh There it is. Grassland forest, perfectly fine. Okay, so let's go ahead and release the other one now. Our second Struthiomimus coming out there. Hurrah! Awesome. Okay, so we got those all released now. What I, oh, yeah, what I want to do. Skin, I wish I could. Oh, there it started to work. Take out some of those trees there. So that way we have more of an open view. And we may go and place down another feeder on this side. Where's the feeder? There in front of that viewing platform too. So we have that. Of course our Ceratosaurus. Let's see if they're all happy. Yeah, social population. Looks like they're all good. Okay, so creation lab, is it this? Oh yeah, forgot I did another one of those. There we go, our third Ceratosaurus. Looks like by the thing down there in the bottom, looks like we may have unlocked the second island finally, which is awesome that we got that done. So we may take a look at that real quick. I know I do want to start setting up a second pin, which I'll probably do offline. Yeah, the social's as high as it can go, so that's probably the best that we can do. It's 100% comfortable. There we go. Isla Muerta is unlocked now. Our new island. Open emergency shelters. Yes. Ranger Site team base. You manage crisis. Isla Muerta. And it investigate new diseases. A newly developed island. The name, roughly translated, and I do mean roughly, the island of the dead. Of the dead. Fitting. Humorous, even. So we will stay here real quick. Let's go ahead and just stay here. Let's see if that unlocks. Because I know you unlock new stuff. I don't know if it. you have to go to the second island to do it. Um, it's showing there's something new. I don't know what it is new that we're... Oh, that's probably just the Draco Rex. Yeah, so we have new... Okay. Because I thought once you got the new island, you... Or, you upgraded. I don't know. Let's just get out of here. Okay. What else? I'm swinging around the wrong way. Which is fine. Let's do an expedition. So we still have, let's go back for this Hoangasaurus thing over here. 
I'll send out for that and now let's check our fossils of course we have our Draco Rex fossils there we go which should be going up there let's check to see what that other little dino made it to 48 percent so I th it must be 50 before you can even do any yeah it must be 50 percent okay well is there anything else that we can I guess we might as well do research because um because I think by what I've watched other people do let's see Maybe we'll go ahead and just do some of these things to get them unlocked. Um, because since I have more money on this part, because when you go to the second part, usually you go like in debt pretty bad because of not having it hardly any money. But over here somewhere, I would like to build, um, start working on another pin area, which I may do real quick. Let's go ahead and view um, the second. Oh, that's a lot of stuff I unlocked. Um, I don't know if we have any struck to life. 50% gene. I thought I did that. Oh, I must have to do another one now. Train as you fight, and when the moment comes, you'll act without hesitation. Let's do it again. Okay, let's do it again. Or do another. I'm gonna need you to extract source. enough DNA from fossils to incubate and hatch a dinosaur. So this I had the that. first phase of this mission. Yes, I know. Carry on. So I, as I mentioned, I had that earlier, and. Then there was this guy um, some gym. other mission yeah, took over, so I had to, it had to cancel it out. And threat. Okay, so we got all that. I never finished anything. We can do new contract. What's low? Security is our lowest. Security isn't always clean or easy, but it is always necessary. Okay. So look this we can do tasks. Oh yeah, we need to add. I forgot about that. We need to add. I don't know how many guests we have. A, uh, what you would call it? A, um, I knew I was going to have this issue of not being able to remember stuff. A hotel, that's what I'm trying to spit out. So over here, because I, I think we have, um, let's see. No, that's not what I want to see. The map again. Yeah, we have all this area over here to use. So we can put in a hotel over here. Um, I don't know exactly where I would have liked to put it closer to the train station here but I guess we kind of used up all our room maybe put it in here and then over in these areas construct uh, more dino pins because um, then in the other one I can do the Draco Rex and that Hoangasaurus hopefully they are fine together um, I want to do that but let's try and look at our islands here we have okay capacity dino dinosaurs so maybe more dinosaurs but where do we go to there we go so let's just take a look at this park real quick so here we'll be transferring okay so here's our new island Isla Muerta weren't enough to contend with on this next island Isla Muerta you may yeah. have uh, storms some are big problems you know storms extreme weather that kind of thing from time to time so as you can see we have a whole bunch of see, repair the weather on this island can be a little temperamental first thing you're going to want to do is fix any damage this storm has caused you should use a ranger team to get the park operational again oh and don't forget to close any emergency shelters when it's safe to do so guests won't spend their hard-earned dollars huddled in a bunker underground will they hmm? So it looks like the storm, and it seems that bad weather. So we have all this room here. To bad behavior <laughs> much bigger park area. If you believe that everything is connected, the so-called butterfly effect, and I butterfly do effect, butterfly, then one small change is all it takes to create a series of toppling dominoes, leading to rampaging dinosaurs. And they don't make a butterfly net big enough to stop them. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and fix this stuff real quick. Looks expensive. You should get that fixed and soon. A ranger team is equipped for that. Oh, see, we're losing money like crazy. Um, see if they can. Cause I thought it. Oh, that's got no power. Um, look how bad this weather is. So let's go. 
fix this real quick. Okay, so I guess you just click it. Now, this is probably why our ranger station thing isn't working. We gotta fix the power here. Um, let's go... Oh, shoot. I can't drive this truck very well. Okay, apparently, once again, I'm not used to driving this. Let's go this way and repair the stuff over here. Nope. Nothing here. It's probably on the other side, I think, if I remember. Oh, shoot. There's what I keep meaning to. Let's go around over here. I can't drive this thing. And then the fence over here, yeah. Okay, let's see what that, what do we need to do now? Yeah, we'll close all the shelters. And we'll... So I'm trying to figure out what we need more than anything right here. Of course, dinos will go ahead and get a dinosaur going. Probably just get a Struthi going on one side just to get some dinosaurs incubating. So we have an attraction to go on for over here. And then on this side, we'll go ahead and do one of the Ceratosauruses. Oh wow, that's expensive. So hopefully that'll bring people in. And I hope there are people. I don't see any people walking around. <laughs> are there any people here? Train? Have you just the train arrived? Okay, so I assume we got people coming in. We'll release the Struthio just to have the thing to end off here. And I'm gonna go, you know, going back to the other island, start working on some additional buildings to construct again to get a hotel and everything put in there for that. And let's go ahead and add in here a feeder. Just so we have that one, and over here we will add the meat feeder. There we go, so when we get that done. So I think that's going to be, of course, we awesome that we did make it onto our second island here, Isla Muerta, which I'm pretty sure is the uh, island that we're on, if I can remember right. Yes, everything looks fine. We've got power everywhere. I don't see any guests in the park for some reason. But I don't know about that. Arrival point should be all good. But we made it to, like I said, our second island. We got lots of money down. Hopefully some people start coming in. We start making money, hopefully. But I hope you enjoyed this episode of Jurassic World Evolution. Episode number three here. We, like I said, moved on to our second island. And hopefully more people start filling into the park and getting this money. And then I'll work on the second island as well to try and get more... Uh, money going on there hopefully or to get the park up and r running more over there and make more money because I think once you unlock research on this you can go over there and do it as well and since I have a lot more money I can use it there um, but I thank you for watching this episode leave me a thumbs up if you enjoyed and don't forget to subscribe to see more episodes and we'll see you next time <laughs>